Good evening. Thanks for joining us. Peter Chura is off tonight. Three people, including a 15-year-old boy, have been arrested after a hail of bullets at a house party killed three people over the weekend and injured three others. All of them face first-degree murder and attempted murder charges. As Global's Lorraine Nickel reports, all suspects are believed to have gang connections. Um, people said that there was blood all over. There was, you know, it, it was just like being a, in a real horror scene. Three masked men stormed this house on Alexander Street early Saturday morning and started shooting. When it was over, six people were shot, three dead. 22-year-old Corey Keeper, 26-year-old Jennifer Ward, and 31-year-old Scott Lavely. James Laughlin was lifelong friends with Scott. I'm shocked it happened, but um, the thing is, he always took someone else's problems on. He went out of his way to help them. Police have now arrested a 25-year-old, an 18-year-old, and a 15-year-old with the shooting. They're facing charges of three counts of first-degree murder and three counts of attempted murder. James says his friend Scott was at the house party with about 20 other people. That's when the three suspects showed up uninvited. Numerous people told them to leave. When he told them not to come back, they took that an offense and brought guns back. Police say the suspects are members of a street gang and the mass killing is not random, but it's unclear what the motive was or if they knew the victims. There is certainly a gang, gang affiliation there. As far as the suspects, uh, not as far as the, uh, the home. Neighbors say the home was usually quiet. Uh, yeah, younger family like us, I'd say. Uh, yeah. Lots of kids running around all the time, so makes Are you wonder nice? where the kids were when that all was going on. But. Sasha Sinana goes to school with Joshua, the 15-year-old boy that lives at the house. He had a friend with him at the time, and they were upstairs just hanging out, and then they heard what was going on. They heard gunshots, and they went downstairs. No children were injured. The three others who were shot are recovering in hospital. Lorraine Nickel, Global News.